I haven't done any timing tests yet, but here's a song that you requested. I put this together in a very short amount of time, so we're gonna see how it goes. Not to mention I'm doing this at school, so we'll see. Stuck with eighth notes for the vocals. In the slower song, I'm gonna go for simplicity. No reason to overstep this song. The song, the flow is what I feel is important, not the song, because I love the vocals. I can't remember his name. I know Kenya is his last name, or first name. Great voice. So I put emphasis on the vocals a lot in this song. It's a very refreshing switch up. I switch it up about every six measure, or every measure, which is every 16, 16 minutes. I know there's lines, but it added a lot of much needed character to the song. Anyways, that's what I have so far. I thought it looked really good, so I'm eager to hear back from your comments, so let me know what you think. Oh, one miss. Oh, that's so gay. Anyways. Yeah, I'll work on the other difficulties later. I don't know what difficulty you play, you still haven't told me that, so if that looks like the kind of difficulty that you like, I'm trying to get a, you know, I'm trying to appeal to multiple crowds here. Not to mention I made that, all those steps, if you haven't noticed, I don't know if you play DDR on your, on pads, or if you've ever played DDR on your feet at an arcade, but my steps are made for the feet. I mean, that's very important to me, is the flow of a song. If it can flow well on your feet, it'll flow well on the keyboard, so... That's the reason for some of my note placement being somewhat repetitive at certain parts. Look on flow. So, anyways, I'm at school, so I should probably make this short. Tell me what you think.